Hey guys, this is Beth with Midlands Vinyl. Today I'm going to be showing you how to pattern fill your font using Silhouette. So this is the image that we're going to be making. I am designing some sublimation transfers for pillowcases and I'm going to show you how to make this. Let me show you first how to add your patterns to your silhouette library. Um, it's a very easy process. It's literally drag and drop. So you're going to click library up at the top right hand corner. You're going to find your pattern wherever you've saved your patterns, your pattern folder. And all you're going to do is left click and drag. You're going to select another one and select another one. And then all of your patterns are right here. So they've all shown up and now they're ready to use. So you're going to go back to design you're going to type out the word hello or whatever word you're using. I'm going to make this a little bit bigger so you can see. I'm going to go up here and change my font to Amarillo. I want to right click and weld. And now I want to fill my inside of my letters with a pattern. So I'm going to change the outline up here under line style. I'm going to change it to pink. And then in my fill button, you have solid color, which is, you know, your regular color palette. Then you got gradient and then you have patterns. So all the patterns that we just saved will show up in this window. This is the one that I'm going to be using. So this is how easy it is. You have your word selected. You see this box around it. That means your word is selected. All you have to do is click. Boom. There it is. Now we're just going to find we're going to type out spring and I'm going to change that font to adorable wishes. I'm going to make that font black on both. So we switch back to fill color. I'm just going to weld this so it shrinks it down to actual size. So as I'm measuring, um, I know what the actual size is. We're going to make this a little bit bigger. We're going to stretch it out a little bit and you are done. So now all you have to do is save this and you can print it. If you're doing sublimation, you can print it and put it on water slide. If you're working on water slide, you will essentially be able to do anything you want. You cannot cut this with your silhouette because it is a pattern and your machine is not going to cut all of these little pieces out. So I hope this video was helpful. Um, I will be sure to drop a link for Creative Fabrica where I got my digital backgrounds. Um, if you have not done so, please give this video a thumb up and make sure that you subscribe and that way you don't miss any content that we put up in the future. Um, I hope this was helpful and I hope that you have a fabulous day.